Yo, what is going on guys? My name's Oh My God, your head's gone, and as you guys know, the Valentine's Day Massacre DLC was released today. But with that DLC, there was actually a massive patch release. So patch 1.10 or 1.10 is now officially out, and I'm going to link you to something down below in the description where you can check out every single patch note if you want more details on the Rockstar website, but I literally couldn't even cover it all in this video because so so many things were patched literally pages and pages of things were patched so I'm gonna be going over the main things that were patched or that have been included in this update so first off we have the rat loader vehicle when there was that really kind of big modding vehicle kind of thing going on in Grand Theft Auto 5 online a lot of people really liked owning their own personal rat loader vehicle and, uh, and Rockstar listened to them. You know, it's not the fastest vehicle, but it's just one of those kind of classic vehicles a lot of people really like to have in the garage. And now it is back, so it is online. You guys can go and buy one, and you can actually insure it, and it can be your own vehicle again. So let's move on. Next up, the mechanic has been removed when delivering personal vehicles. So you still ring him up on your phone, but rather than him driving up to you now, your actual vehicle will just kind of spawn right beside you, which is... I don't know how I feel about that. I kind of like the mechanic. At times, he'd be driving in weird spots, and he, you know, he'd get a bit cracked out. He'd always scratch my car, but uh, you know, it's not a big change. But it's still pretty sad to see the mechanic go in that scenario. You know, there will be no more me killing my mechanic every single time I get a personal vehicle delivered to me. So next up. We will now earn cash when we complete solo races, which is nice. Sometimes I try to start a race and nobody joins, and I just want to try the race out, so it'd be nice to have that little bit of cash to earn at the end of the race if I put my time into it. Another thing that was fixed was the bad sport timer. If you guys have ever been stuck in a bad sport lobby and that timer was broken, I know there was one time where I, I was supposed to be in bad sport for one week. It ended up being like three weeks. It went from seven days to one day, back to seven, uh, back down to one, and, and it was all over the place. So it's going to be really nice that that is now fixed. And, uh, and hopefully people don't have issues with that anymore. Also, a couple of exploits got patched. So the car duplication vehicle glitches that were still out, those got patched. And then some RP glitches during missions were patched as well, which is a good thing. Another thing that was patched that has been a problem for a while was the cornrow haircut issue, man. Uh, people were having cornrows on their head even though they never got that haircut and, and they couldn't get rid of them and I can't imagine how annoying that would be if that wasn't something you wanted. Again, if you guys want a full detailed list of all the patch notes, definitely check out the actual Rockstar released article down below in the description and you guys can go through it. Trust me, it is so long. You guys will probably not even believe me when I say it's a song, but go check it out. It is like pages. I'm scrolling for days down there. And, uh, and Rockstar has really been putting in that time getting those glitches patched. But anyways, guys, that's it for this video. I'm going to be making another video later today showing off some of the new DLC stuff, the new Tommy gun, some of the new suits, stuff like that. So if you guys enjoyed the video, don't forget to hit that like button and, uh, and leave a comment down below. Tell me what you thought of it. And if you guys are new to the channel, subscribe. That would be great. Otherwise, thank you guys so much for watching the video. Have a great day. Peace out.